Okay, ignore the screen. I'm gonna show you how to change your big O ID. So let's get out of the screen and go to your homepage. So your homepage will come up just like this. Now you click on me on the bottom right hand side. And now what you want to do is you want to click on your face or whatever picture is right there in the center where your name is. Click on that right there. Now we're at your profile. What you're going to do is you're going to click the square at the top right hand corner. This is for iPhone, so it might be slightly different for Android. It might look slightly different, but the concept will be pretty much the same. So click the square box on the upper right hand corner. Now what you can do is you can you see your handle at the very top, your name. That is not your big O ID. That is not how people will find you. People find you by your big O ID. So if somebody searches for you, they're going to have to search for your big O ID because it will not show up by your name. So if you see there's name, gender, birthday, hometown, uh, language, emojis, and then is big O ID. That right there is what you want to change. Um, Cause it initially starts off as a number. Here, I'll come back on camera. It initially starts off as a number and um, uh, the numbers are hard to memorize, uh, to remember. And if people don't know your number either, they're gonna try and search for your name and it's not gonna come up. So if you are in an agency though, make sure you either screenshot that number or tell them your big O ID before you change it and then tell them what you changed it to after you changed it. Cause otherwise you won't get paid. You want to get paid. Um, so just make it easy for people to find you, change your big O ID. And, uh, now, yeah. Any questions on your big O ID? Let me know.